I finally saw UFC 205. And here's my thoughts on UFC 205. What was I watching? As I saw Woodley beat up Wonder Boy and didn't get the win. Woodley, to me, put on the better fight. And we just got through sitting here watching this. And I'm like, what fight was they watching? First round, Woodley got, Tyrone Woodley got the guy on the ground, pounding him. Dropping the elbows on him. Woodley's more of a uh, takedown guy, more than a striker. He can strike, but he's more of a takedown, get you on the ground type guy, but he got fast hands. You know, this is what the UFC don't promote. You don't see Anthony Rumble Johnson. You don't see Tyrone Woodley promoted the way they should be in the UFC. Because they want to sell you jokes like Conor McGregor. Now, don't get me wrong. As the fight hit, like, round four, I think that's when you start seeing... What's his name? Wonder Boy start landing some jabs and he's got more to stand up. He was using his reach and he landed some good jabs and was doing all right for himself. But I say probably round two and round five, because round three was like a slaughter. He was <laughs> dude getting knocked into the rails, getting dropped. And I'm like, well. He got that round. Didn't happen that way. Didn't happen at all. Then you look around. And you got. Um, what's the uh, main event? Conor McGregor. Versus a guy who shouldn't have been in the ring. Eddie Alvarez. I think that was the guy name that was paid to show up. And it, it went just as long as I predicted. Two rounds. Um, did Conor McGregor even get touched in the fight? Really? This was the fight? He's the first ever two division world champion. Seriously? I don't know where you get that from. I have no idea why or how it even came into existence due to the fact Conor McGregor is basically fighting a bunch of, in the UFC, nobody's ever really done it before because they weren't allowed to. There didn't used to be weight divisions, one. Now... They take out weight divisions. People either had to abandon the title. They weren't allowed to have to. So, really, there have been a lot of two-time champions. People had to leave the belt, go somewhere else, and win the belt. So, there's been really been a lot of them. I mean, Anderson Silva done it. You've seen numerous of fighters do it. So it's not really saying anything. It just sounds good and try to put them in the realm of like boxing. The two division world champion. <laughs> <laughs> then this idiot comes out and talk about. I I want to be paid just like. I hear that Conan O'Brien owns part of the UFC. I want I won't fight again until I get my fair share. They bought into the UFC in a collective group. You were not in that group. It don't work that way. Deal's done. <laughs> Your name is not on the ballot. <sighs> no one's going to write you in. You're not bigger than the sport or the company, rather. You're just an employee in it. Take your money that you made, go home, and blow it. 
that's all you do. Um, assessing the fight. Uh, Alvarez is too slow. Conor McGregor can just land his laser left over his shoulder all night long. Keep knocking him down. And that's basically what it was. It was whitewash. Get him an easy touch after getting in there in a real fight, two fights in a row. First fight, he didn't come out of it. Second fight, they snatched him out of it and gave him the victory. So, that's my assessment of UFC, whatever number that was. 205, I think. So, take it from there. I'm out.